North Korea says it carried out successful tests of a new long-range cruise missile over the weekend. State-run media releasing photos of what it calls a strategic weapon of great significance that traveled some 1,500 kilometers before falling into the country's territorial waters. Now that word, strategic, it's considered a common euphemism for nuclear-capable system. That's according to a senior fellow at the U.S.-based Carnegie Endowment for International Peace, as quoted by Reuters. South Korea's foreign minister says the latest test by the North shows the urgent need for dialogue. The comments coming during a meeting Monday between South Korean and Australian officials. don't intend to speculate on what the intentions uh, might have been uh, with those uh, launches, but I would reiterate Australia's consistent statements that have called on the DPRK to make a sustained commitment to talks with each of the Republic of Korea uh, and with the United States. As for nuclear talks between the U.S. and North Korea, they've been at a stalemate since 2019. Now, word of that missile testing, it comes a week after National Day parade celebrations in Pyongyang. No ballistic missiles on display at the nighttime event celebrating North Korea's founding. Instead, an apparent nod to the fight against COVID-19, with people marching in orange hazmat suits. As North Korea's leader Kim Jong-un looked on. Melissa Duggan, City News.